volunteer. I sincerely hope you have some reason for bothering me. I've already stated that I wish you to leave. Mighty mage of Baragost. Baron Gaskill suggested you might be interested in examining this vial. It is a poison that was used to taint ore from the Nashko mines, causing problems with the ore, with the iron ore along the Sword Coast. A remarkable compound. It must have taken a skilled alchemist to concoct this. I may be able to formulate an antidote to salvage some of the current iron stocks, although I doubt it will be sufficient to resolve the crisis. Leave it with me, and I will contact Tyrum if I ever have any success. Iron ore solution. Let's look at that. Okay, he's looking at the vial. He's going to try to make an antidote. Tarum Firum is examining the ore. He should now be able to produce less brittle iron as a result. Hmm, let's talk By to him again. By the Thalantir, a mighty mage of Baragost. Rumors talk of a powerful mage that lives out here. If it is you, I would like to speak with you. Rumors? Bah! There is no mage here that wishes to speak or be spoken of. Unless, of course, if you have magic that you wish to sell. We are interested in selling or even buying magical items. What do you have? Let's see what he's got. He's got a row of good Archmagi and a neutral Archmagi. For over 30 grand, what does this stuff do? Plus 5 armor, universal saves, plus 1, and 10 spell resistance. Unfortunately, we can't afford that. Let's see what else he's got. He's got some magical ammunition. And he's got a lot of scrolls here, it looks like. Relatively cheap. What have we got for potions here? Potion of healing. Hmm. Hill giant strength, 453. Well, it gives me bull strength? Hmm. Potion of mirrored eyes, what does this do? Hmm. Protects the recipient from petrification. Potion of regeneration, 1500, wow. What else has he got? The Claw of Kazgaroth, 32,000. Constitution, minus two. Plus one deflection. Armor bonus, 4 deflection against piercing. Improved saves against acid, divine, mind affecting, positive energy. And reduced saving throws from death. The Horn of Kazgaroth. Hmm. Hmm. Unlimited use of bubble gives the user a partial magic resistance and a saving throw bonus as well as partially deflecting incoming missile attacks. Lasts for 18 seconds. Hmm. It's got some good stuff. Okay, let's use oh, Amwin. Amwin's got a level up, so let's take care of that now. Continue being a rogue. Appraise. Disable. Hide. Move silently, open lock, search, spot, tumble, use magic device. And I still have three more points. Let's put listen. And what else is going to be of use? Maybe sleight of hand and set trap, we can put them in there. Yeah, let's put one each in those. And sneak attack increased. Alright, let's have M1 talk to Thalantir and see if we can get a deal here. A mighty mage of Baragost. We were interested. Alright, let's see. Will he so. buy this junk that we have? Okay, so we sold some junk. Didn't buy anything though, it's pretty expensive. So let's get out of here. All right, back outside. Step with me. Come on. 
Follow along. Let's continue on exploring this whole place. So we've been in this area here, so let's go up this way. It looks like some kind of shack, and we'll check out that transition. Check this whole area out here. Who is this? There's somebody over here. Permidian Stark. Hmm. Let's do a quick save here. And see what this guy's got to say. Speak up. Whoa, Speak slow up. Down. I'm trying to plan the grandest of heists here. With all your tromping about, I can't hear a word I'm thinking. Of course, you can't hear a word you're thinking. You have to say it out loud first. Okay, okay. Here's a the plan. There's a big time mage living just over that rise. Magic items scattered all over the place, I'm betting. Trouble is, he's got these two hideous flesh monsters guarding him, and no shadows where I can lurk. Brute force is useless against the monsters. Everything is useless. There must be a way to outwit the witless, but damned if I know how. Ah, hell, I guess I'm better off just finding a halfling village somewhere to pick on. The dive is all yours. Hmm. Stopping crime. It seems I've accidentally altered the course of a future history by stumbling upon the thief, Permidian Stark, as he was planning, in his words, the greatest heist of all time. His will and concentration broken, he has left me here to ponder the situation. Paul Fomage lives nearby. Yeah, we know. Guarded by horrid flesh beasts. Stark claimed that they were too tough to kill, but that there might be a way to lure them away from the action. Oh well, I can cross that bridge when I come to it. Hmm. Alright, let's go check over here. Let's see, do we go over this way? Uh-oh. What we got going on now? A skeleton. Well, let's go get him. Tore his ass up. And pick up some more remains. Alright, let's look at a map here. Hey, let's take a quick look around this corner. I don't know what's over here, but... I want to look anyways, for exploration purposes. And another skeleton. Oh, a whole bunch of them. Alright, Brandwin, do your thing. Turn undead. Mm, that'll take care of them. Nice job, Brandwin. What else we got over here? And I guess that's it. Nothing of importance. So, let's pick up some of this junk and we'll sell it later. Well now, what do you want? Alright, continuing on. Got a building over here. Let's go check this out. Oh, there's somebody over there. Kyvan. And some more skeletons. Branwen, go do your thing. And that'll do it. Okay. Let's pick up all these remains. Okay, so we got a house here, but I can't do anything with it. Uh oh. Another skeleton. It's just one. Let's just fight him. Took his ass out. And some more junk. And I'm encumbered. Let's move some of this gear out.
Well now. All right, let's head over to want? this transition over here. Anything back this way? No. Let's see where this goes. Nothing new. All right, let's head down here. There was somebody standing around over here. Is that him right there? Yeah, and some more skeletons. Let's see if Kenneth can turn undead this time. Yep. All right, we got Kyvan. Let's go see what this guy's about. And let's do a quick save. Okay, so let's see what this hey, Kyvan's all about. It is not often that I come across strangers in this part of the world. What takes you out this far from civilization? Your adventure is ready to smite any evil that darkens our path. A strange coincidence. I have a similar quest to your own. I have been hunting the bandits in the region for the past few months. Perhaps if we work together, we would fare better. What say you to that? We'll help you against the bandits, but only if you tell us why you've spent months hunting them. Their leader, an ogre named Tezak, took the life of someone very dear to me. Thanks for being honest. You can join our party. I hope that we will work well together. And we got Kyvan's Revenge. Party's full. Well, I guess Minsk and... Dinah here. Time for them to leave. So let's send Minsk out of the way. Yep, Dinah here is going with him. Okay, so... Let's take a look at Kyvan. He's a second level moon elf, chaotic good ranger. Let's see, anything spectacular? He's got a dexterity of 19, strength of 15, and a wisdom of 13, and a really low charisma with an 8. And he's currently got point blank shot, track, and weapon focus longbow. Archery combat style. Favorite enemy, reptilian, humanoids, and undead. Alright, let's level him up, shall we? Okay, let's see. Let's give him some survival, some spot, and crank up tumble. Okay, so it looks like he gets toughness automatically at third level and he gets rapid shot so what can we get him next no use getting that rapid shot what do they recommend improved initiative should probably get dodge what else will come in handy yeah, I'm going to use him as a w missile weapon guy, so... Let's... let's go with improved initiative. And next level up. And recommend dexterity 20, that'll work. And let's kick up some listen. Spot, survival, tumble, and I have one left. Maybe move silently. Yeah, let's let's put it in let's put it in hide for now. There we go. And an animal companion got a badger named Scion. That'll work. I don't mind a badger. We'll keep that. Okay. So let's see. He's got a suit of studded leather, some bracers that don't do anything. I think I still have that suit of studded leather plus one. We'll probably give that to him. And he's got a short bow, a bunch of arrows, and a spear. All right, so I'm gonna sort out his equipment. I believe so. Okay, sorted out Kyvan's gear. 
Now we're back down to a five member party again. So maybe we can pick somebody else up somewhere. Let's pick up these remains here that we left. Alright, let's continue. Searching the area here. Let's take a look. Where are we at? We're right here. Uh-oh. Getting attacked already. Got some skeletons. Alright, let's go up here and do some undead turning. Get some. There you go. Okay, so while we're here, let's bring up Kyvan's animal companion. Got the crazy ass badger. Well now. Scion. What do you want? Okay, let's pick up all this stuff. And let's see. Let's continue searching the area, see if there's anything else that we missed. Okay, so Kyvan had a journal entry on top of that. Oh, now what are we fighting? And some more skeletons. Let's turn them. So we had that journal entry. Let's see. Kyvan hunts after an ogre named Tazok. He has told us that Tazok has killed someone close to him. And I have agreed to help him in his task. Well, that'll come in handy. As you wish. All right, Kyvan can start picking up some of these drops here. Step with me. Come on. Follow along. All right. I guess we're gonna head back to Bear Ghost. Now what? Damn. Spiders. Give us victory. Let's get him. Damn, they came up with some skeletons, obviously. Alright, took them out. Well, at least nobody got poisoned. As you Let's see. Kyvan, can you pick up any more of this stuff? Okay, so we got all that stuff. Let's head back to Baragost, I'm thinking. 